This is uh, Rafe from the Plugin India Review Team and here we are in uh, Sanjay Gandhi National Park. It's also known as Borivali National Park. Uh, it's a quiet place uh, full of nature and you can see trees, you can hear the birds chirping. I suppose the reason why I can actually hear all of this is uh, this is so quiet. So you're wondering what this is? Well, it's a cycle. Uh, it's an electric cycle. This is from a company called Hurikal. And uh, this is their top end model called the Medley. They've got lower end models as well. And this one is uh, priced at around 32,000 because this is the upper variant with a larger battery capacity with uh, disc brakes front and rear with better shock absorbers front and rear. So that pulls the price up and a better seat which is basically this gel filled seat. It is quite comfortable and uh, it has over here as you can see a very wide hub. It's a brushless DC motor attached to a lithium ion battery with a charge indicator that tells you exactly how much charge is left. It's showing us that there's 60% charge left in the battery and uh, that means I can go about 20 kilometers more because it has a 30 kilometer range and a maximum speed of 30 kilometers per hour which is quite sufficient in small city in signals and traffic of course on the highway we did feel the need for more speed and uh, of course we used good old 1 HP human power and we pedaled our way to 40 or 50 kilometers per hour down the slopes was also fun uh, the most fun was up slopes and uh, I got a lot of uh, cyclists lot of motorcyclists around me wondering what the heck I'm doing going up hill without pedaling on a cycle and literally they asked me this on the way up the hill and it was tough but I looked at them and I answered them and they were very pleased and they finally got the logic of it <laughs> this bike is uh, the kind of product that we want to see in the market yes. with lithium ion batteries we would love to see regenerative braking uh, probably a couple of things like uh, rear brake indicator light so what's really good about this cycle is uh, the super torque you get uh, the wonderful acceleration at very low speeds the stop and start uh, it's absolutely a joy to start uh, on signals, in traffic, uh, for anything. Normally on a cycle you find yourself uh, very reluctant to brake, very reluctant to slow down because then you have to uh, struggle very hard to catch up to speed again. Frame itself is very sturdy, it's a little bit heavy. Uh, it could do with maybe a lighter frame, uh, better balance because the battery on the rear feels a little bit off balance, maybe a different battery placement. Uh, Again, what's good is that it's got lithium ion, it's a light battery, very short charge cycle and uh, very convenient indicators both on the battery and uh, on the charge uh, charge point, uh, on the charger as well. Quite easy, here it goes, it's off, I just put it back in, there the battery is in the slot again and you just lock it and now it's on. So you have to switch on the battery from here and uh, once you've switched on the battery, then there is a on and off switch over here which you can use while riding which is very convenient here it's on here it's off so by mistake you don't just end up accelerating it's only deliberate and there it goes <laughs> okay and they have a headlamp which i really like it's quite bright it's really good uh, in the dark we tried a night ride yesterday and it really was able to illuminate uh, the area ahead of the cycle and the fact that it's wired to a powerful lithium ion battery means it doesn't dim down when you slow down the speed which is what happened with normal dynamo based uh, headlamps so this is a nice touch that they've given this headlamp and uh, it's got telescopic shock absorbers uh, of course uh, these are possible to be upgraded you can get better ones uh, same way we've got a rear shock absorber and it does a decent job but i probably maybe not for my weight class maybe for somebody twice my weight so they could have a lighter uh, suspension here which would uh, do better on the bumps yeah yeah so one more thing that the company could do which they assure us as possible as an upgrade because they are willing to upgrade mix and match whatever i want they're saying any cycle parts can be put onto this so it would be good if it could sell with gears we have the horizontal battery we got a nice led indicator we drove all the way from bhando to santa cruz and it shows you that it's gone down to 30 percent charge and that's a nice handy indicator even in between the ride you can see and uh, here we go i will now connect the charger it's got a very easy plug-in uh, i like that and uh, this is a much more advanced charger it's got a better bms of course it's lithium ion so that's why and here we go 
or power it on and as you can see there is a green light which says that it's getting proper power the charger is powering on it's starting its cooling fans and the flashing blue light as it says over here is charging mode let's check the battery and it says already that it's building up charge it's, that's great that's indicating that the battery is being charged indeed so alright i think we leave it for a good half an hour and one hour and let's see how much time it takes to complete the charge uh, full charge mode will be a green led and uh, right now it's 11 5 let's see uh, when the full charge is done although we haven't discharged it completely here we are charging using the clicker charger as you can see it indicates very clearly what means what and the clear indication what's going on and here it tells us oh it's almost fully charged so within half an hour let's see we started about 15 minutes ago the status is now almost full enjoying the charging process very sure uh, final thoughts uh, this is a great bike yeah. this is a great bike uh, but i think they've got the idea they've put in lithium ion i think they should go in for better frames and the uh, uh, brake indicators right. and uh, i think uh, they should target people who are really interested in cycling and ec ecology okay. and good luck to Hulikil. Uh strength to you my friend, strength to your tribe.